Hi everyone, this is a reading. We are going to have a look and see what is coming through for you. I hope you are doing well. If not, I really hope I can help you. This is for all star signs. So if you are watching this, hello and welcome. I really hope I can help you and we will see what is happening. All right, so I just wanted to mention that if you wanted to win a free reading with me, check out the description box below since I do giveaways every single month. If you wanted to purchase any personal services with me, they are listed on my website, shopmoonlightguidance.com for personal tarot readings, intention items, and rituals to manifest different areas of your life. So there's lots of different rituals on there for love, marriage, money, um, healing, there's evil eye removal, black magic removal, actually evil eye and black magic removal, protection ritual, um, home protection, and so many other rituals on there as well, which work on healing your energies so that what you want can manifest um, without spell work because spell work is dangerous um, and I don't do that. So um, that is that. And also wanted to mention that there are thousands of five-star reviews on the intention items as well, which thousands of people have seen results with. Intention bracelets, there's candles, stage bundles, teas, embroidered cards, um, prayer beads, and just honestly, so many wonderful things on there as well. Okay. So let's have a look and see what we have for you. I saw it. I saw it. I saw I literally saw the card, okay? <laughs> when you see a card, you just can't unsee it. And guess what? It is the Four of Wands. We've also got here as well the Knight of Pentacles. And we've also got the Eight of Swords. Seven of Pentacles. Page of Cups. I mean, look at this. Look at this. Unforgettable. Isn't there a song? There's a song, isn't it? You are unforgettable. I cannot sing, but oh well. <laughs> um, listen, your energy is literally unforgettable. There is a person here that pretends like you don't exist, okay? Because they are trying to get you out of their mind. They are trying to move forward. They are trying to move on. But listen, no matter how much they try to move on, they just can't move on. Your energy is attractive. It is magnetic. If you look at the Four of Wands, which is the card that I first saw, you can see that one person is dressed in red and the other one is dressed in blue. It reminds me of those old-fashioned magnets where one side is red, one side is blue. You get another magnet magnet, the blue and the red, boom, they attract, right? So there is that energy here of just this magnetic, unforgettable energy that you really have within yourself. And there is a person here that just is trying to like move on. They're trying to like forget about it, but they are not going to be able to. And the reason why they want to forget about it is because they feel like they've never felt this way towards someone. And it actually scares him so much that it is scary. And they want to basically not feel as um, scared and that's why they're trying to forget about you they're trying to move on like oh this is too much I can't deal with it but actually they just they just can't you know it's just something that they literally and physically um, just cannot do you know like they literally can't stop thinking about you um, and that's just what we see here you know in so many ways it's just something that is impossible for them to do they just can't find a way to basically do so. We have here the page of pentacles, okay? They just find you super attractive. They find you attractive emotionally, but also mentally. The things that you've said, the things that you've done, the truth of how you are as a person, how kind and genuine and just so generous and loving of a person you are is something that is really, really special to them. They really do like you and they do care about you and they do feel bad about, you know, trying to basically forget about you and pretending like you don't exist when you actually do. So that is another thing here as well. We have the two of wands. We also have here the page of swords. They really do feel like you are so kind and so caring and just such a genuine person. We also have here as well the knight of pentacles. They feel like you are just such a lovely person and that you are super, super generous and genuine with your time and your energy. They also feel here as well that your energy is just so incredibly attractive and they they can't forget about you. Okay, I've said that a million times. Look, they're going to be coming they're coming, going to be coming towards you, okay? Like, they literally just can't forget about you. If you've been recently on a date with this person and then you've found that they have not really messaged you back or they've ghosted you or they haven't said anything back, they are still thinking about you. Like, they may not have said anything, they still think about you, okay? If someone has ghosted you, I feel like there is regret where they actually feel bad about ghosting somebody like you. So there is this sense of them still thinking about you, still comparing you to others. Um, the truth really has come out, okay? So that is the affirmation for your reading. The truth is out. The truth comes out comment it down below in the description sorry in the comment section below because they do compare other people to you okay um any kinds of other conversations they've had with other people have not gone very well and they do feel bad about how they have treated other people how they have been towards other people it does make them feel bad it does make them feel sad that 
you know, the energy that you have is just so unlike anyone that they have ever met in their life before. They feel bad, they feel sad, they feel regret, they feel ashamed to have treated people really badly and really not well, you know what I mean? Um, they just feel sad, they feel frustrated, they don't feel good at all for treating people how they have treated you and it really does make them feel quite upset, especially with the six of wands, they are going to be coming towards you, there's a lot of reflection here that will be happening where they realise oh my gosh, why am I not coming towards you? Why am I not progressing things with you? You know, I feel attracted to you, so maybe I should explore that, you know? <laughs> There's a sense here of them actually connecting the dots and actually thinking, okay, look, I feel something here. Let me try and see what this all means. So, you know, people around them can pick up that they still have this attraction towards you, especially if people know about you and they know about him or her. And... What is it, whatever is happening between you and this person, you know, like people think that they are drawn to you because you're attractive and you are an incredible person. So people that know both of you, for example, they know that this person is attracted to you because of all of those qualities you have, but they are trying to deny things, but people around them know that they are trying to deny things, even though they feel so strongly connected to you. Okay, so no matter how much they try and deny things, they, people around them absolutely know that that's just not it's just not happening, especially with a hermit, you know, because deep down they have these strong feelings. They're not really telling anyone, but people can pick it up and the energy is, is still there towards you. Just because they're not doing so much towards you or they're not saying so much towards you does not mean they don't like you or they don't care about you or they don't think about you because they do. They just aren't saying it. They're not making these grand actions and, you know, gestures to show that. They, they really do care about you and they really do like you as I'm literally waving around the lover's card. When you see a card, you just can't unsee it, and literally I'm just waving it around like this. But listen, you know, clearly they have those feelings towards you, and they are going to manifest and grow and come together and progress, and they will, you know, they will be coming towards you. They will have something to say. They will want to move things along, you know, and I, I really do feel in just so many ways that there is, sense, there, there is this sense of them being like, I really do like you, I do care about you, let me do something, let me help you, let me move things along with you. Um, there is definitely a very, very strong energy of that taking place here, which is something that I personally am picking up on. So that's really what we do have here. Um, you know, they are feeling very connected to you and quite clearly just because they're not saying anything or doing anything doesn't mean that you are out of sight or out of mind because they still, they're trying to get you out of sight and out of mind, but it's not working. So there is that whole situation, but clearly they feel a lot towards you okay so let's see what the message cards have i really do need you and don't ever change who you are exactly see these are affirming that their feelings towards you are still super strong that they really do have feelings towards you they really do need you they want to be with you they want to be around you they do care about you they do really like you they do respect you they have feelings for you quite clearly and they feel very connected to you as well and they really do feel that you are just such an incredible person like you are genuine and kind and caring and just such a magnetic person who is literally so attractive and they are going to come towards you okay they will literally tell you that you know, they haven't been able to stop thinking about you. They feel this need towards you to do something, to be around you. And that's because there is a spiritual connection between you both, which by the way is picked up on in three cards. Okay, so these are three very divine cards. We can see that here with Judgment with the Angel. Four of Wands is known to be a very divine card. And of course, you've got the Angel in the Lover's card as well. So clearly, you know, they feel this spiritual connection to you where no matter where they wander, no matter where they go, no matter what they try and do, they can't stop thinking about you and they don't also want to, you know, stop thinking about you either, which is another thing that I am really picking up on. So that is what we have here. Like they really do care. They don't show that they care. Okay. They're not telling you that they care necessarily, but they do care because in their mind, they can't escape their mind. Okay. You might not see inside of their mind, but they see inside their mind. They know what's happening in their mind, and that is for sure. So this is your reading. Now, of course, if this resonates with you, um, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to comment down below the affirmation. Um, I am magnetic. Okay, comment it down below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Check out the description box below for information on personal services, free reading, giveaway, intention items, and so much more. It's all listed down in the description box below for your convenience. There's, um, you know, of course, the intention items, personal services, readings, items, and there's also TikTok and Instagram, which thousands of people have seen results with. So definitely feel free to check that out. 
um, as well if you wanted to and it is literally all there for your convenience all right so take care everyone and i will see you all very very soon bye